Hey YouTube, this video is going to be about earthing, also known as grounding, the benefits that it has on the human body, and uh, what my experience has been with it having slept on a grounding mat for the past three years. If you're not familiar with grounding, it's the concept of connecting yourself to the earth, and I don't mean that in a hippy dippy way, I mean uh, physically or electrically. And uh, basically the thing is, in our modern life, in our modern society, we live inside, we, uh, we don't go outside in nature as much, and when we do, we wear shoes with rubber soles. So we're basically insulated from the earth. It turns out by having this modern lifestyle where we're not in physical contact with the earth, we build up a positive charge in our body. and. Uh, this positive charge has all these little effects on our body and they aren't positive despite the fact that it's a positive charge. Uh, either way, by touching the earth, the earth has like an abundance of a negative charge, uh, electrons, and that just surges through our body when we touch it. So that's how grounding works. I'm gonna show you some images and uh, I guess you're seeing them right now, but basically on the left side you have blood cells that are uh, sticking together and uh, this is before doing grounding. And here on the right side we have blood cells after 40 minutes of grounding. And you can see that they're way more like loose, uh, maybe not loose, but they're like uh, not sticking together. They're uh, just flowing freely by themselves. So what are the benefits of grounding? The benefits include improved immune function, digestion, sleep, injury healing, blood circulation, faster exercise recovery, normalization of certain hormone rhythms, reduced inflammation, and reduced stress. And note that these are not just claimed benefits, these are actually benefits that have been found in studies done on grounding. And I'll add a link below to a site that has all the different references for these um, studies. For example, there was one study where they had the participants exercise and then half of them would sleep on grounding mats while the other half wouldn't, although they thought they were because it was a double blind study. And uh, basically what they found is that the people who slept on the grounding mats had way higher pain tolerance when those muscles that they exercised were squeezed. And also what they found is a reduced amount of white blood cells in those who slept on the grounding mat, which suggests that the body didn't need to produce as many white blood cells. If you didn't know, white blood cells are uh, what the body creates in a response to inflammation. So essentially by being grounded, these people experienced less inflammation. The guy who discovered grounding was Clint Ober and he's an old fellow and when he discovered it, he had had terrible insomnia and pain for many years and when he, the first time he ever like discovered this, he slept on like electrical pads connected to the earth. The first time he did that, he slept through the entire night and that was something he hadn't done in many years. So one effect that grounding can have is improving your sleep. I discovered grounding about three or four years ago and I purchased a mat, a grounding mat for about $30 and I got it right here, let me show you. It's this thing right here, it's like a, a rubber mat. I put it under like my feet in bed and uh, you, connect, you connect it to your socket and it, it, these things are just plastic. It's just to connect it to the grounding in the socket. And um, yeah, that's pretty much what it looks like. I think this is like coated in carbon or something which makes it conducive. And the, the mat is approximately one millimeter thick. I measured it earlier and um, I don't really notice it in bed. I, I think I would notice it more if I had it like on my upper part, on my back or something. But having it down at my feet, I really don't notice it in bed. And uh, the mat does really work because um, I use the multimeter to check my body voltage. And uh, when you're grounded by touching this and you use a multimeter on your body, you'll see that it goes towards zero, meaning you're grounded. So the big question is, what have I personally noticed by using a grounding mat? 
and I have to disappoint you and say I haven't noticed anything at all. Uh, it's kind of a bummer, I know. Uh, it would be awesome if it just like magically had some crazy benefits. But for me personally, I haven't noticed anything. It might be because I'm relatively young. I don't really have sleep issues. I don't really have issues with pain or inflammation or any of the things that it's supposed to help with. Um, but I would say that I still recommend it because if it does have benefits, which it obviously does according to all these studies, then I see no reason why not to have this mat under your bed sheets and um, just sleeping on there without like you're not doing anything for it you can just sleep on it and you might have some benefits for it so for that reason I uh, recommend actually using one of these so yeah that summarizes everything I had to say in this video I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope it helps you out thank you for watching goodbye